Hi everybody, welcome to Rosa's Kind of Cooking. Today I'm going to be making some uh, meat and potatoes and some eggs. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, i got a couple of pieces of meat here, these tiny ones, that I want to finish up. And what I'm going to do is uh, put some seasoning into it. And uh, I didn't marinate it, so I just want to do it with a little bath dip in there. And I've got my uh, diced potatoes here. Let me go ahead and put some of this onion in there. And I'm just going to put a mixture of everything in here. A little of everything. Oops. Just don't really like that one. Never came out good. Some rosemary. Put some seasoned spices. Garlic salt. Meat tenderizer I always like to use. I think that uh, takes care of everything. I mean, it's, it's perfect. I like it because it uh, softens everything up. Okay. And I've got to try this um, Worcestershire sauce. it all up again. Put some more of this on here. I'm going to leave this off. I think that might be broke. I'm using it so much. And a little bit more onion. A little bit more pepper. Oops. There we go. And I'm just going to bay this in here. Doesn't matter if it's a really thick steak or thin steak. This is just thin steak that I have here. Okay, I'm gonna turn this on. My stove on. Put a little bit of, um, you know what? I'm gonna use canola oil. It's not heavy. I think vegetable oil is a lot heavier. I'm just gonna use a little bit there. I need more. I'll use it. So I'm just gonna wipe that up a bit there. As soon as that heats up a little bit. Let's see my potatoes. I'm using canola oil because the olive oil is a little bit too strong for my taste, though it is good in certain foods. Um, just depends on what I'm making, but otherwise, something like this, I'll just stick with the uh, oil. And put these in here. Lay these up in here. taste Worcestershire sauce. There we go. Let's cook up a little bit. 